Hey guys, good morning. So, um, it's like 10.30, I think. Yep, 10.31. And, uh, hopefully in the next hour, half hour, me and my mom are gonna leave. Um, we have to take care of my grandma, especially after everything that happened yesterday, um, with that stuff. And, uh, so we have to do that, and then... We need to go to the mall to to return, I think, something for my sister, a few things. Uh, so yeah, I was an idiot last night and didn't start my infusion until like almost one o'clock in the morning, so I'm kind of stuck on it for another two and a half hours, but I'm hoping that I can get up soon. Um, I have noticed that it's a lot easier for me to wake up if I take pain, medica me pain medication before I try to, like, get out of bed. And it's been working really well, so I guess maybe I should start doing that. But anyway. Anyway, anyway, and I keep saying this, but I need to get my garden stuff, like, under control. I need to figure out what to do with it. And I'm thinking also now about growing aloe as well. So we'll see. I don't know. I need to. I need to get myself together for that. So I will see you guys soon. That's why. Dad is so cute. He's got the dog. Oh. He, he can't go inside, and he probably doesn't want to leave the dog outside. Oh, look how cute that dog is. <laughs> yeah. Good morning. I'm getting my coffee. Yeah, that's so adorable. Gotta get my morning coffee in. So. Microphone is done. Microwave is done. I want to throw it out. Micro okay, microwave. What? I don't even know what I'm saying. The microwave is done. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I think I'm losing my mind. Bye, I love microwave. Too small. Is that a gray in it at all? Um, a little bit. Because, um, you know that. Of course, you guys don't have my hoodies <laughs> or sweatshirts, so this is definitely definitely happening. I just walked into the area dressing room. This is awful. I wasn't Oh, I can't even. I really can't even imagine.
just say that it is it absolutely made my day to walk into um to walk into a store into a dressing room and see all of those notes everywhere it was just such a beautiful thing and like i was very not you know like body positivity like not in that way but i was just very anxious today and then to walk in and see like all these post-its that all these people put in i don't know it was just so beautiful and it was in every single fitting room i just thought it was such a beautiful thing and it really really made my day um i was taking a lot of pictures and stuff because i thought it was just so so sweet and so beautiful um so uh i actually i don't wear like normal bras that have like a wire or that are push up i just find them to be too uncomfortable um so i don't really wear those but this one is basically like you know it doesn't have a back it's not anything you snap these aren't adjustable like it's just breathable fine and the shape is nice on me and everything and then this bra i got um you know just for home or if like i'm wearing something that um we require like a bralette instead of a regular bra then I can wear this too for it, so I just figured that that was good. So those together were like, those together were 42, and then they gave me a free pair of underwear, um, because I think it was above 30 or something. Then I really love the soft and sexy, um, What's it called? The line, like the collection. Um, I really, really like it. So I, they were buy one, get one, 50% off. So I got this one, which is just like a regular shirt. And it, this is like um, mesh sort of. Um, so yeah, I really like this. That's on both of the shoulders. And then the other one I got. The other one I got is this one. I think it's like a uh, Henley in purple because I don't really use this color very often. I wanted to try some new colors. And last but not least, I got this jacket. And it's super soft, it's small. I don't know if it's in... Yeah, it's not the soft and sexy, but... Um, so yeah. Yeah. So I thought that I would just show you guys. I mean, in total, I think my stuff was like 60. Um, and... Uh, yeah. It wasn't terrible. Not terrible. I got some really good products, um, really good clothing that I'm definitely going to take advantage of. Um, so yeah, it was like today was a really really good day. I'm so happy I spent part of it with Adrian. And I almost choked. <coughs> I'm glad that the nausea I was having passed because that was really awful nausea. That was really, really bad nausea. Um, so that is what's up. I think I'm just going to hang out, um, catch up on some YouTube, and um, I'm going to take my sleeping medication soon and hopefully go to sleep. <laughs> but today was a really, really good day. Hopefully you guys can see. Yeah, you guys should see me. Um, so I have been doing some yin yoga, which is basically like going into a pose and then keeping the pose going for like um, 10 minutes or something so your body just kind of naturally sinks um, in and it gets you into a deeper stretch and blah 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 so I was really craving because unintentionally I've been like taking a break from essential oils and I want to make a relaxed blend to like something that would help with um, like anxiety and stuff like that so I'm doing a 10 milliliter bottle. Um, I'm using patchouli, lavender, lang lang, cedarwood, bergamot, and frankincense. So I am going to make that blend right now.
Okay, so all of the oils are right down at the bottom. And then I'm gonna be taking um, fractionated coconut oil um, and fill up the rest of it to the top. I'm putting it in a pink um, roller bottle. And put a little bit more. All right, and then I just put the little the roller pla plastic piece with the metal roller. This goes on the top, and so stick that in, and then you just kind of shake it up, shake it up. And so I haven't smelt it yet. Let me shake a little bit more. Definitely, definitely good for anxiety. There's something in there I'm smelling that is a little bit off, but I might just make up for it later. Um, like, maybe add something a little bit more fresh. So, going back to yoga.